Welcome to another edition of Standard & Poor's Latin America Monday Morning Roundup. I am your host, Borja Orlando. Here are our weekly highlights for the region. We raised our rating on Honduras to B+, plus as a result of an improvement fiscal performance and stable debt burden. We expect continuity in key economic policies, including energy sector reforms, for the next two years, anchored by the country's agreement with the IMF. The outlook is stable. We also raised the rating on the Chilean-based pharmaceutical company CFR Pharmaceutical to A-, given an improvement on its liquidity to strong. And subsequently, we withdrew the rating at issuer request. The outlook was stable at the time of the withdrawal. We revised the outlook on the Brazilian-based power holding group Energisa and its subsidiaries, Energisa Paraiba and Energisa Sergipe, to positive and affirm our WB ratings. The positive outlook reflects our view that its credit metrics could improve further over the next few years due to its operating improvement, especially at the electricity distribution assets that Energisa acquired from the acquisition of Rede Energia. This could lead to a more conservative financial risk profile. Finally, we upgrade our issuer and senior secured debt ratings on the Brazilian-based sugarcane processor, Tonon Bioenergia, to triple C-. At the same time, we raise our unsecured debt rating to double C. The upgrade follows the closure of the exchange offer on July 13. We also place all the ratings on credit watch with positive implications, which reflects a likelihood that we could raise the ratings within the next few weeks after a more detailed analysis of the company's operational performance and capital structure. This was another segment of our Latin American news. Thank you for watching and we will see you next week. <laughs>